So this is the second question from heat transfer subject uh, belonging to gate 2018 evening session. So the question says in a steam power plant the steam is condensed in a condenser at 30 degrees Celsius. The cooling water enters the condenser at 40 degrees Celsius and leaves at 22 degrees Celsius. So basically uh, the inlet and outlet temperature of both the hot fluid and the cold fluid are given to you. So it says if the total surface area of the tubes is 50 meter square. So basically this is the interface that it is the heat exchange area between the hot and cold fluid and overall heat transfer coefficient is 2 thousand watt per meter square kelvin uh, per meter square kelvin then what is the rate of heat exchange so let us see how to see, solve this question see always remember whenever we talk of heat exchangers that are part of uh, uh, power plants that are part of refrigeration cycles so most of the heat exchangers are counter flow heat exchangers because the heat exchange between the corresponding fluids will be most effective this comes from the concepts of thermodynamics right so what we have is we have a counter flow heat exchanger in which the steam is getting condensed and the temperature of the steam is 30 degrees Celsius. So what you can simply say is the THI which is the inlet temperature of hot fluid, THO the outlet temperature of uh, hot fluid both are 30 degrees Celsius. Okay. Now the cooling water will flow in opposite directions. So cooling water inlet temperature is 40 degrees Celsius that is TCI and outlet temperature is TCO which is equal to 22 degrees Celsius. So in order to find out the heat exchange rate what we could you do is we could find out that what is the rate of heat loss by unit mass of fluid when, when it flows uh, unit mass of hot fluid when it moves from the inlet to outlet or what is the rate of heat what gain by the cold fluid when it flows from inlet to outlet but for solving this we need the mass flow rate right then only we can find out the rate of heat exchange but in this case the mass flow rate is not given to us right so instead of that what we will do is since u is known to us a is known to us if somehow we are able to find out the mean temperature difference we will get the heat transfer rate also so for this what we will do is we will use LMTD, met LMTD method logarithmic mean temperature difference will give, which gives you the mean temperature difference of hot and cold fluid. So what it says is that mean temperature difference is nothing but the temperature at 1 minus tempera min temperature difference at 1 minus temperature difference at 2 divided by log of the ratio of two temperature differences. Now what is theta 1? Theta 1 is THI minus TCO since this is a counter flow heat exchanger. Theta 2 is TH O minus TCI okay so based on this theta 1 becomes 8 degrees Celsius theta 2 becomes 16 degrees Celsius so logarithmic mean temperature difference which is this will be equal to 11.541 degrees Celsius now what will be the heat transfer rate it will be equal to overall heat transfer coefficient into the interface area into the mean temperature difference substitute the values and you will get an answer that will be 1154 kilojoule per second okay so i hope the question is clear to you and uh, for any query or any assistance you can contact the, on this number which is uh, on the right hand side of you okay so thank you